The following demonstration shows how easy and simple it is to personalize content using EpiServer. With the R2 release, EpiServer makes it possible to know who your users are and serve them personalized content. This demo shows how a typical company, in this case a hotel, leverages this powerful new capability to its financial advantage. So let's look at this from the eyes of a prospect. For instance, say my name is Charles. My anniversary is coming up and I'd like to take my wife away somewhere romantic. So let's see what I can find. I'd probably start with a simple search along the lines of romantic weekend break. This one looks interesting. <laughs> well, it's certainly interesting, but not very romantic. I think I'll have to keep looking. What just happened? In the eyes of the hotel, I just lost a potential customer, and lost customers mean lost revenue. But Ebby Server 6 R2 changes the game because everything can now be personalized. What if that same hotel company could personalize content to reflect exactly what Charles said he was searching for, a romantic weekend break? So let's look at how simple it is to personalize content in this example. With EpiServer, I'm able to personalize content based on visitor groups. For example, let's create a visitor group called Romantic Visitors. I can define a visitor group based on any number of criteria, search keywords, time of day, location, etc. Here, I want to define my group as those using Romantic as a search keyword. I also need to create a default group. Here I'll name it Everyone Else. For simplicity, I can just set the criteria for this group to be everyone that is not a member of the Romantic Visitors group. With my visitor group defined, it's time to personalize the content. If we go to our home page, let's first define the text we want to display to our default group. I do this by highlighting the text and associating it with the Everyone Else visitor group I created. Now I create the text I want to show to my romantic visitors group. With that in place, now let's go find an image that really captures the romantic theme I want my site to project. I do this just like I personalized the text, first by associating an image with my default group, and then associating a different image with my romantic visitors group. With everything ready, I now just save and publish. If I want, I can double check my work. Now let's replay this from Charles' perspective. I type in the same search. But this time, when I click through to the hotel, I'm presented with personalized content, making it far more likely I'll take the next step and make a reservation. With EpiServer, the same hotel could personalize content for all of their key segments. People looking for a romantic break, or booking a business meeting, or even their wedding. And that concludes the demonstration.
showing how easy and simple it is to personalize content using EpiServer.